Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is another weight loss update for you all. Um, it's a bit later than I thought. I thought I was actually going to get a chance possibly to film it in the week, but I was really, really busy. Today Sunday, by the way. Um, kind of hoped to have done it on Saturday really, but I always just seem to be really busy. So I'll get straight on to what happened and it's not all that good really. So just check you can see that, yep. So as you can see here, I've actually gained half a pound and I was sort of kind of expecting it really. I didn't have the well, a very good week. Every week I think this is going to week I'm going to be really on plan, I'm going to do really, really well. And yet I still seem to find that I was struggling again like I was the previous week. I just, chocolate is a big issue. Um, thank goodness I've got rid of all those little mini tiny little salted chocolates because I bought them thinking someone might knock on Halloween and no one ever does and I don't know why I bought them maybe it was because I wanted them rather than the fact that someone was going to knock on the door I just fancied them and I think that's what that was about and I made the mistake of, of buying a packet and they had 25 little bite sized ones I had probably well over half and my partner he must have had the other half <laughs> or less than half shall we say um, that was a mistake I thought yeah I can really incorporate it within slimming well but I know myself that if I do have little tiny little sweets I find that doesn't satisfy me and I keep reaching for more and more and more and it's a disaster and I'm so pleased that they're gone I'm pretty sure I haven't I can't find any more so I think they're all gone I don't think there's any more in the, work, the fridge at work there's no more in my cupboard so they're gone so I sort of kind of thinking about what has kind of triggered me to eat it why I keep going for more is because I want more and it's too small so I then decided in actual fact maybe I should be thinking about having a normal size chocolate bar to try and stop me from wanting more because I think if you're sort of if you were not on any sort of healthy eating type thing and I think that if you had a chocolate bar every day then you would just have one chocolate bar every day and that would be it and you would be happy with that but somehow having small little tiny chocolate bars to me doesn't equate to one big one and I'll just eat and eat four of them and that's way more than what I should be having anyway so I've decided that what I have bought is I've gone back to having my 12s again which is just one finger um, they're 115 calories per finger and I think that works out at six things and I've also bought Crunchy which is they're a multi-pack and I think I've shown them on my tops and flops before and they're six things six things each I think or seven I'm not I'm not entirely sure I bought the smaller ones out of the there are two different multi packs and there's one that is slightly bigger and there's ones that are slightly smaller I think they're six things I'm not entirely sure um I can't remember <laughs> they might be seven actually I'm not sure no I think they're six I think they're 120 calories or around 120 and the 12s are 115 so they both work out at six scenes each. I'm, I'm pretty sure about that, actually. So that's what I've done. Um, Scene-wise, yeah, seemed to be a, a struggle because of the chocolate and then everything else that I was eating seemed to have some sort of scent attached to it as well, like the ready meals. I couldn't be bothered to do any batch cooking. And because of that, <laughs> I had ready meals which has scenes in and that kind of annoyed me even though they weren't high but it was enough that I thought no this is not gonna work you know I've got I've got to try and be having free my meals need to be mainly free sim free meals so I'm lucky I only put half a pound on really when I start talking like that it should be way more <laughs> but <laughs> um oh dear that's not terribly good uh, not to mention I did go out for dinner I went out for a curry with my boyfriend my partner 
and it was a spare of the moment. I don't know why we did it. We don't usually do things like that. We normally go home, we have our dinner, but we were going past, it was still kind of early. It didn't look particularly busy and we'd never been in the restaurant before. We'd ordered takeaway from that. And I thought, why not? We were gonna just get takeaway. <laughs> I said, well, why don't we just eat that? <laughs> they was doing the washing up, so we ate there. But it wasn't totally on plan, but I didn't think I did bad. So I had, we didn't order starters, but they came over and gave us free um, onion barges with a tamarind sauce. And what else? Um, yeah, so I get it, we had that. And then I ordered the dried ticking, tikka chicken, which I don't love it, but it's not that bad. If I, ha if I have to have takeaway, I'll have that. I'm happy with that. And obviously that came with salad and my partner he had some of it as well so i didn't have the whole lot i had rice which obviously plain boiled rice that is free um we also had naan um unfortunately i probably devoured like a good half of it maybe uh, a bit less than half yeah oh well so that was that and then obviously i had a little bit of his dinner which I can't remember what he had. I can't actually remember which it was to completely it wasn't one we normally have. So I had some of his curry as well. And we also ordered a side of aubergine curry, which um I actually really quite like. And aubergine is quite good for you, isn't it? It's speed, isn't it? So it didn't equate to like one quarter of a plate speed, but it weren't bad. With that and probably the salad, I probably didn't do too badly. Um obviously it does have oil in and at the end of it they said that we could have free liqueurs which they were really good actually they gave us like two free things which i thought was really good so i had a little shot of baileys with ice it was really nice and um oh not to mention i had <laughs> no after dinner they usually give you mints or something like little mints or chocolate um they had these strawberry bonbons they were so good i had two of them they were really tiny about that big that was it's hardly anything really but to be perfectly honest, I didn't really count the whole week since. I, I wasn't on the plan, basically, I can't lie. Um, so not very happy, but obviously the damage wasn't too bad. I obviously limited it by not picking so badly with my choices when I went out to dinner. And that's kind of really been it for the week. Let me just sort that timer out. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about that. I'm just time is here. I'm busy um, <laughs> doing a load of batch cooking, which I'll get to in a minute. Um, yeah, so I thought I did okay, really. So kind of this week, um, obviously half the week's already gone. Um, I went to my usual group, by the way, so I was really, really happy. Even though I had a terrible week going on but I was so happy to go back to my own group because I had really missed it not going to it last week or well, the week before because obviously um we'd gone to a different group and it was so big but this one I'm just I'm really comfortable on this one but despite that I'm not going to this group that I usually go to <laughs> again on Tuesday the Tuesday coming because I've got a hospital appointment and I have to work so many hours um that day at work it may end up me taking the day off completely and my friend doesn't want to have to keep coming all the way down here every single week to take me because obviously we both we live very close to each other here but work unfortunately is about 30 35 minute drive so ignore that beeping it's uh my chips <laughs> fancy chips Slimming well chips, of course. Um, so anyway, um, we've decided to go to a different group on Wednesday. It is one that my friend's been to before and she says it's very good. It's an area manager as well who runs it. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. Apparently the area manager is really good as well. So it might be okay. Sorry, I'm kind of thirsty. <laughs> um, so, after that's that gone 
thought I'd better tell you about that. So if you're waiting for an update on Tuesday, on Wednesday, it might not happen until Wednesday or Thursday. So that's kind of it really. Um, this week I'm being strict, <laughs> really strict, because obviously we're coming up to Christmas, my wish is not going to happen because it will happen if I work on it and I try my best to do a good job and stick to plan but if I don't stick to plan I'm never going to get that and obviously I've got I can't remember exactly how much I've got I need to lose we said eight pounds by Christmas and now I, I don't know when I said that sorry about all these timers going off I do apologize um so I don't actually know kind of where I'm at with that um gonna say seven pounds at Chris by the time it gets to Christmas I'll try for more but I'm a slow loser I can't promise anything I can't imagine that I'm gonna lose like loads of weight uh, so this week crack down on it I've done well I'm doing batch cooking I'm actually filming my batch cooking as well but I'm doing it as separate recipes so can you watch out for those they'll be coming up soon I think one might not come up for a week, maybe a week and a half, I'm not entirely sure. The one I'm doing at the moment will probably be up pretty soon, maybe a week. And then the other one I'm going to cook for dinner, I haven't decided whether I'm actually going to film or not because it's a recipe I've never done and I've just done one with a recipe that I've never done and I've got in such a pickle. <laughs> you can't tell on film but obviously I've, I've got things wrong that are not quite right so that's why I'm thinking on this one I may not film I'm not sure I haven't really decided yet um, but you might see it come up I've also got two recipe videos that I filmed absolutely ages ago and I'm thinking about putting those up at some point as well even though it will be out of date but I will probably change the front bit maybe do a new introduction or something because obviously things have changed since I filmed them I think when I filmed them I was doing Weight Watchers and now obviously I'm back doing Slimming World again so I don't know we'll see so yeah batch cooking um oh did I go to the gym I think I might have gone to the gym as well yeah I think that was the other thing that probably helped with not putting too much weight on because I went for a gym session I did like two hours in the gym and I was really exhausted afterwards and I've only just <laughs> I recovered about four days ago but it took forever to recover from it so that's kind of it really I'm going to leave it there and I'll probably come and speak to you Wednesday maybe after group I'm not sure it could end up being the weekend again because it doesn't finish I don't think until 8 30 so by the time I'm home it's going to be really really late so nine-ish and I have to sort out dinner I don't know we'll see keep an eye out anyway and I shall see you in my next video oh one other thing I've completely forgot um I just want to welcome all my new subscribers I can't believe how many I've got I think when I looked this morning it's 149 what <laughs> what's happened <laughs> anyway I just want to welcome you all and I hope you enjoy my journey and uh, yeah so let me know how you're all doing down below and I shall see you soon. So yeah, bye.